I think this is a bit of a tricky question, trying to work out which of these shapes will fit to the into a 2x4x4 two by four by four cuboid. Well, let's first of all draw a 2x4x4 two four by four cuboid. Um, so I'll draw it so it is not that high, but it's going along quite a lot, and it's going to go in this dimension quite a lot as well. Quite a nice approach is to we see that um some of them are going into like they, they involve all three dimensions this one here because going along and up and into the page and this one here is as well so i'm going to focus on the first two to start with because actually although this one's going into the page it's not it's only got one dimension in the x direction so essentially this this one here and this one here are just uh essentially they are just two dimensional so i'm going to try and fit them into a one by four by four cuboid because if we can do that we can just repeat it for the other part and we're done and this can be done by if we go there and there yeah we can just do the same again down here it's going to work so because we can fit it i've not drawn the other dimension in but you can see it I can do it to this top layer, do the same for the bottom layer. So this is definitely going to be possible. Let's take a look at this one here. It's a little bit of a trickier shape. Okay, so maybe we try here. And then have to do this and then this and you can see it's also going to work okay get this other dimension in and so on but this is possible as well now the others um you know we can't fit into this one dimensional sort of space but we've got to think about how else we could do it in as a simpler way as possible and instead of looking at uh again the whole cuboid maybe we break it down so maybe we just look, can we put it into a two by two by two cuboid? Or, or should I say cube? Because if we can do that, we can just again repeat it in space. And it's quite quick to see that this one is going to be possible because I can literally just take it and kind of rotate it and have it coming out here and going up. You know, you can see it, you can see it forming. So that one's going to be okay. This one's a little bit trickier. Um maybe it's best to draw a cuboid okay so i'm actually going to draw a cuboid in two parts i've got the front part here and then i'm going to have a back part so let's say i put it here 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 and it's going to be going into the page and end up here so it's like an l shape and then it's just going into the page but you can see i've got exactly the same here i've got an l shape and then it's just coming out of the page because i'm allowed to make a copy i'm not allowed to reflect it but i can rotate it and um, yeah we can see that that will work if i just sort of turn it around so it's facing the other way then it is gonna it is gonna be able to go along up and then into the page so i've satisfied myself i hope i've convinced you if you're not so sure then maybe time to bring out some multi-links some cubes or something and and show that it works i think this one's the hardest one personally but it's also possible and therefore how many shapes you can actually do it in all four ways